been meaning to do Iazel's Park for some time. So I'm in Iazel Park at Darnell. So it says here, 20,234 hectare park, or 20.234 hectare park, was acquired by the corporation in 1894. And previous to that, it would have been like a stately home or a small stately home. So here you can see the house and at the right hand side is the lake. The lake doesn't exist but I think I can actually go up to where the lake was. What I'll probably do is I'll probably end up stopping the video and actually starting again when I get up to the house. So when I get up to the house I'll restart the video if I find anything else interesting because you get a feel for what Iazel's Park is like without me giving you the full monitor. So this is another view of it before I actually get up to the house. Some lovely trees in here. One thing I've noticed which is probably a lot different is there's not many uh, flower beds, just grass and lots of trees and I'm guessing a lot of the stuff from the past has disappeared. So I'll get up to the house and start the video camera when I get up to the house. So I'm now at the house on High Hazel's Park which would have been like a small country, country estate. There is some information on it somewhere so I might come across those boards. But you can see that it's actually the actual Tinsley Golf Course here. So it sort of stretches out to Tinsley Golf Course. Some tennis courts around the back. I just see tennis courts through here. And I remember there being a garden here as well. If I have found a garden. So I'll just pop in the garden. You can see the tennis courts better down there. We've got the uh, bowling green just here. I'll take you in the uh, garden first so we've got a sensory garden I can imagine gardens used to be a lot better than this in the past looks like it could do with a bit of a cut with a feature in the middle going to show you the golf course and then I'm going to try and find out where the old boating lake was because last time I came it was marked out so there you can see it's just Tinsley golf course so let's go and see if I can find out where the actual boating light was so I've located some information and it says formal garden so you can actually see the difference on how the garden used to be with the lovely flower beds and then you can see how the garden looks now So 
So you can see the old house now, which is the golf house. You can see number one T here. And it looks like the old boating lake was where the three trees are all around that area. But last time I come, I thought it was only five or ten years ago. The actual old boating lake shape was actually marked out with stones. But I think this must have been a, an addition to the golf course. They must have changed the golf course around and, and banged it up there. So if you look at the three trees up there, and you look at the house down there, that probably should confirm exactly where the boating lake was. Such a shame to lose that a lovely boating lake because I've seen pictures of it but you know it's that elf, elf and safety ELF safety it's absolutely ridiculous so that's it just a quick video of IIUSL's Park and the main features